नमस्कार दोस्तों आपका अपने चैनल मनोज गुप्ता एकेडमी में आपका स्वागत है दोस्तों आज हम लोग क्लास सेवेंथ के जनरल साइंस में लेसन नंबर एटीन साउंड प्रोडक्शन ऑफ साउंड इस लेसन का एक्सरसाइज करने वाले हैं सो फ्रेंड्स अभी तक आप लोगों ने इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब नहीं किया तो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब और चैनल लाइक कीजिए और अपने फ्रेंड्स के साथ शेयर कीजिए दोस्तों आप लोग इस वीडियो को अच्छी तरीके से देख करके अच्छी तरीके से सुन करके भी इसके क्वेश्चन आंसर बाहर कर सकते हैं यह है लेसन नंबर एटीन साउंड प्रोडक्शन ऑफ साउंड उसका एक्सरसाइज कर लेते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फील इन द ब्लैंक फर्स्ट साउंड इज जनरेटेड बाय द रिदिमिक डैश ऑफ एनी ऑब्जेक्ट द एंसर इज वाइब्रेशन साउंड इज जनरेटेड बाय द रिदिमिक वाइब्रेशन ऑफ एनी ऑब्जेक्ट सेकेंड द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ साउंड इज मेजर्ड इन डैश द एंसर इज हर्ट्स द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ साउंड इज मेजर्ड इन हर्ट्स थर्ड इफ डैश ऑफ साउंड इज डिक्रीज इट लाउडनेस ऑल्सो डिक्रीजेस द एंसर इज एम्पलीट्यूड इफ एम्पलीट्यूड ऑफ साउंड इज डिक्रीज इट लाउडनेस ऑल्सो डिक्रीजेस फोर्थ अ मीडियम इज नेसेसरी फॉर डैश ऑफ साउंड द एंसर इज प्रोपगेशन A medium is necessary for propagation of sound. Now next question. Question number टू Match the pairs. Group A and group B इसका match करना है The answer is first flute vibration in the air. Second frequency measured in hertz. Third sound level decibel. Fourth ultrasonic sound frequency more than ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड हर्ट्स Fifth infrasonic sound. Frequency less than 20 hertz. Now next question. Question number थ्री Give scientific reasons first. In earlier times, people used to listen for the arrival of a distant train by putting their ear to the rail. The answer is first. While the train runs on the rail, its wheels bang on the rail and friction occurs. Second, this banging and friction produce vibration and sound is produced. Third, this vibration propagate to a large distance or through a solid medium. such as rail that means the sound travels over a large distance through rail for if ear is put to the rail this sound can be clearly heard and the arrival of a train can be guessed thus in earlier time people used to listen for the arrival of a distant train by putting their ear to the rail now next second the sounds generated by a tabla and a sitar Are different. The answer is first. The stretched diaphragm of a tabla, when struck, the produce vibration which generates the sound. Second, the stretched string of a sitar, when plucked, produces vibration which generates the sound. Third, in this way, due to the difference in the vibrating object, the frequency of vibration from both the objects is different, and the pitch of sound is also different. Thus, the sounds generated by a tabla and a sitar is different. Now, next, third. If you were both on the moon your friend will not be able to hear you call the answer is first medium of necessary for the propagation of sound second there is no atmosphere on the moon as that of the earth and thus due to absence of medium sound does not propagate while talking on the moon this is the reason why your friend will not be able to hear you call now next for we can hear the movement of a mosquito swing but we cannot hear the movement of our hands the answer is first the up down movement of a mosquito swings occur very fast in one second its swings move about 300 to 600 times that means the frequency of movements of the wings is 300 hertz to 600 hertz the audible sound is produced and the movement of the wings can be heard second on the other hand we cannot move our hands so rapidly the frequency of sound produced by movement of hand is less than 20 hertz we cannot hear this infrasonic sound thus the movement of our hands cannot be heard now next question number 4 write answers to the following questions first how is sound produced the answer is vibrations are produced in an object when it is struck vibrating object is a source of sound the rhythmic vibrations of an object produces sound now next second what does the intensity of sound depend upon the answer is the intensity of sound depends upon first amplitude of vibrations the intensity of sound is proportional to the square of the amplitude of vibration second frequency of vibrations if frequency is higher then intensity of sound is also higher third distance from the source of sound if the distance between the listener and the source of sound is less then intensity of sound can be felt greater now next third explain how the frequency of oscillation is related to the length of a pendulum and the amplitude of its oscillation the answer is first as the length of a pendulum increases the frequency of oscillation decreases that means 
एज द लेंथ ऑफ अ पेंडुलम इंक्रीजेस द नंबर ऑफ ऑसिलेशन इन वन सेकेंड डिक्रीजेस सेकेंड द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ ऑसिलेशन इज नॉट अफेक्टेड much by the amplitude of oscillations that means even if the amplitude is increased the frequency does not change much it remains nearly the same now next for explain the two ways by which the pitch of the sound generated by a stretch string can be changed the answer is first when the tension in the wire is increased the frequency increases and thus the sound produced is shriller also when the tension in the wire is decreased the frequency decreases and the sound produced is less shrill second when the length of wire is decreased the frequency increases thus the sound produced is shriller when the length of the wire is increased the frequency decreases and the sound produced is less shrill using this two way the pitch of the sound generated by a stretched wire can be changed so friends aaj hamara yahan pe lesson number 18 ka exercise complete hua फ्रेंड्स आप लोगों को ये वीडियो कैसा लगा आप लोग कमेंट बॉक्स पे जरूर लिख करके बताइए इस वीडियो को ज्यादा से ज्यादा लाइक कीजिए अपने फ्रेंड्स के साथ शेयर कीजिए ताकि उनको भी क्वेश्चन आंसर मिल सके और इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कीजिए नमस्कार दोस्तों